start kick off the weekend with some locally dense fog. It's not going to last too long, especially in the inland valleys. It's going to burn off quickly. We've got one more day of near normal high temperatures in store for us today. A big cool down, especially inland in store for Father's Day on Sunday and for the Juneteenth holiday on Monday. Those below average temperatures are going to continue for most of next week. Futurecast, well, it shows that fog that's out there this morning backing up quickly. We're not going to see as much of that pop up shower and thunderstorm activity in the high Sierra. So if you're heading up there, Either today or tomorrow, things are looking pretty good. Just a little cloud cover. The best chance of showers is actually going to be on the north coast. There's going to be a storm system heading into the Pacific Northwest, directing just a little shower activity towards far northern California. The effect around the Bay Area is that we are going to have breezier conditions on Sunday and significantly cooler temperatures for a couple of days. Today, though, looks nice. If you're heading out to the A's game against the Phillies, game two of that series, temperatures at game time are going to be in the upper half of the 60s at 1.07 p.m., reaching up to around 70 degrees by the time the game is wrapping up. High temperatures today, well, within about five degrees on either side of what is normal for this time of year. So, again, one more day of close to average temperatures. We're going to hit the low 60s along the coast. Again, average mid to upper 70s down the peninsula with low 80s in the Santa Clara Valley, 82 degrees in San Jose. Right around 80 for most of the tri Valley, but then a little warmer as you head towards the Livermore side of the valley. 85 degrees there. The warmest spots, though, far inland in the East Bay, only hitting the mid 80s. No 90 degree readings on the map, so that's a bit out of the ordinary for the middle of June. Mid 60s in San Francisco, a mix of upper 60s and low 70s for Oakland and the East Bay. Mostly low to mid 70s in the North Bay, though southwesterly winds just allowing with the alignment of the valleys to bring that marine air farther into those inland valleys of the North Bay until you go much farther north where temperatures are more likely to reach up into the 80s. A lot going on this weekend. The Alameda County Fair kicked off yesterday. It is going to continue all the way into early July. 83 degrees for high temperature in Pleasanton today. If that sounds too warm for you, then Sunday's your day with a high temperature hitting the low 70s on Sunday with those breezier conditions as well. North Beach Festival happening in the city, mid 60s for highs today. Tomorrow, only three degrees cooler temperature wise, but it's going to feel cooler because of those breezy conditions that we are going to experience throughout the day. And tomorrow is the first day of the Stern and Grove Festival. Make sure you layer up appropriately. It's going to be breezy, but usually that wind doesn't make its way too far down into the grove. High temperatures only reaching the low 60s and a little bit of that June gloom is going to be floating through as well. Temperatures don't change much in San Francisco for the next several days. Just kind of hovering around in the 60s, a mix of 60s and low 70s at best for Oakland and the East Bay. The North Bay also pretty consistent, mostly staying in the low to mid 70s. The bigger drop's going to be in the Santa Clara Valley, where San Jose drops from 82 degrees today to 69 degrees by Monday, and then bouncing back to the low to mid 70s. A similar drop inland in the East Bay. That's the most volatile part of the Bay Area with this temperature drop at Sun's Way. On the coast, hey, you're going to be nice and consistent. Temperatures hovering in the upper 50s and low 60s.